Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. It's a girl Fanny Lungu back with another reaction video. If you're new to this channel, make sure to give this video a thumbs up, share it with your friends, and of course, do not forget to subscribe. Like I said, my name is Fanny Lungu, and on this channel, we post reaction videos each and every day. So if there's anything in particular specific that you guys want us to react to, drop us a link in the comment section below and we'll do it for you guys. Um, uh, we also have a second YouTube channel called Funny and Jesse 2.0. You guys can go there and enjoy our weekly vlogs. And if there's anything that you want to see on that channel from us, you can let us know and we'll do it for you. We've got a podcast called Diving In with Funny and Jesse, and we've got some amazing conversations which you guys can check out. You can find us on iTunes, Spotify, this channel, and our second YouTube channel for the visuals. And uh, we've got a Patreon as well, Patreon account, you guys can feel free to become members and we we'll appreciate a big shout out to everyone that has subscribed to our channel, is watching, liking our videos, giving us things to do and just uh, sticking with us as we go on this journey. Thank you for being around and just thank you, thank you, thank you. I hope you guys are doing alright and may you stay blessed. Also, right, you can check out my um, blog, Morning Coffee with Funny and my other um blog life of blue or life with blue i'm not even sure i really need to check it before i react next time otherwise um you can check out the things that i read and i also post short stories on my not short stories but short points on my instagram you guys can check them out safani so l on instagram so feel free to follow us on everything else that we do and you can find the links to everything that i mentioned in the description box and just click the links so a big shout out to the person that suggested this the title is not in english but thank you for suggesting it i hope there is subtitles to this or at least i hope he speaks english so that i can actually react to it so without wasting time let's get into the video Shalom, my name is rabbi mort and the video is going to be called prophecies of muhammad the ishmaelite prophet in the Bible and the scriptures. We'll start out with a quick prayer. Aromimcha Hashem ki deltani. Shalu shalom Yerushalam. We start out with book of Deuteronomy chapter 33 verse 2. Hashem came from Sinai and rose up from Sayer unto them. He shined forth from Mount Paran. And he came forth with thousands of his saints. The simple explanation in here is that the mentioning of Mount Paran. Mount Paran is the Mount of Ishmael. Which may refer to also Muhammad. We also discussed uh, Song of Solomon chapter 5 verse 16. Yes, the name Muhammad does show up. It does say Muhammadim, but the name Muhammad is very plainly in the text. I, I also discovered in Isaiah, Ishiyahu, chapter 60, verse 7, which I'm going to read for us. All the flocks of Kedar shall be gathered together unto thee. Rams of Nabioth shall minister unto thee. They shall come up with acceptance of Hashem's altar. And he will glorify the house of, of his glory. So it says, and I will glorify the house of my glory. When he says, and I will glorify the house of my glory, it's referring to, it could only be Kaaba. In Mecca, the sacred house the, for the glory of Elohim that Avraham built with Ishmael. We keep going into Isaiah 60, chapter 1 through 7. In Isaiah 60, 1 through 7, a prophecy about a prophet bringing a light of Hashem to the world. This holy prophet or holy man would appear in a time of darkness filling the world and covering the earth. He would appear to eliminate the darkness and spread the light of Hashem and His praises. In Isaiah 60, verse 3, we read, And the Gentiles shall come to the light. And that means this prophet would arise among the Gentiles and his light. Would fulfill, it would, he would fill this place 
where the nations would come and visit. In Isaiah 60 verse 7, we know plainly as about Kadar, where its flocks and tribes would be gathered together. We go to also book of Jasher, Hayashar, chapter 25 verse 16, which is also found in Bereshit, Genesis chapter 25 verse 13, also First Chronicles 1, 29, and it says, and Riba bear unto Ishmael, Nabioth, Kedar, and Abdil, and so on. I finish this with Song of Solomon, chapter 1, verse 5. I am black but calmly, O ye daughters of Jerusalem, as the tents of Kedar, as the curtains of Solomon. Shalom. قال عذابي أصيب به من أشاء ورحمتي وسعت كل شيء فسأكتبها للذين يتقون ويؤتون الزكاة والذين هم بآياتنا يؤمنون الذين يتبعون الرسول النبي الأمي الذي يجدونه مكتوبا عندهم في التوراة والإنجيل يأمرهم يأمرهم بالمعروف وينهاهم عن المنكر ويحل لهم الطيبات ويحرم عليهم الخبائث ويضع عنهم ويضع عنهم إصرهم والأغلال التي كانت عليهم فالذين آمنوا به وعزروه ونصروه واتبعوا النور الذي أنزل معه أولئك هم المفلحون Short and interesting video there isn't much to say concerning this i just like to urge people to read the religious books everything is there don't forget god will always be there for us and he's given us these holy books as like a guideline to life so yeah that's that let me know if there's anything that you guys want to discuss concerning this the message contained in the video feel free to comment below and we'll be glad to get your response and if there's anything that you guys want us to react to like this drop a link in the comment section below and we'll do it for you guys make sure to give this video a thumbs up share it with your friends and of course do not forget to subscribe and i'll see you in my next reaction video